Hello guys, this is Polina. So yesterday I got booties from Burberry Beauty and I've posted a picture in my Instagram stories and you were all so wanting me to do the review and swatches kind of video and here I am. So I've got two foundations, the Matte Glow Foundation and Fresh Glow Foundation. Also I got two eyeshadow sticks and I've got face contour and I've got cashmere concealer and in today's video I will be using the matte foundation by this brand and I will give you some thoughts and also I will be wearing it for some times and then we'll be coming back and you will see how it's wearing throughout the day so here is the matte glow foundation I have it in the shade medium cool number 50 this is on a lighter side this is um, it's just a little bit lighter than my skin color the pump will look like this actually when I pumped it for the first time I was thinking that the consistency is much more of a double wear foundation but after applying it, I will not say so. Here you can see the swatch. Also for your reference, I will give you my closest shade in Revlon Color Stay, shade number 200. Here is this. This will be a little bit more liquidy and you see the difference in shades. This is my all-time favorite, the double wear in the shade Acru. And I will swatch it for you guys for the reference. I need a clean brush. So here are the three shades, Burberry, Revlon, and Double Wear. So here is the concealer. It has the sponge applicator. And the concealer shade was actually missed for me. You see, it's too dark. But the consistency is very nice and I am pretty sure it will not crease. Why I cannot say it for sure is because I cannot use it around my eye area and see throughout the day how it's wearing because it's just too dark for me. But I used it for my uh, inner corners to kind of cover the bluish skin there and also to kind of prep my under eye area for the regular concealer application. Also I've got the contour stick in the shade medium. It is teeny tiny and also it is very sheer. You will see how it's being applied and what I feel about it in the next couple of minutes. And last but not least, two eyeshadow sticks. This one in the shade Almond. And this one in the shade Rosewood. I really love the eyeshadow sticks, the idea of applying the creamy eyeshadows under the regular ones, I love a lot because it will give you the the depth that you need and it's also kind of a base 
for your eyeshadow application which makes it much more easier and the stain power of the uh, powder eyeshadows will be much longer uh, also I loved how the sticks blend and that they after some time they just dry and they will not move so this was the quick overview of what I got uh, in my Burberry haul. If you want to see how I created this look using Burberry products as well as what I feel about them, please keep watching.
guys so i am back home and it's been um three hours since i'm wearing this foundation which is not too much but still i like how it's wearing throughout the this three hours uh, although I don't like some of the dry patches on my face that were accentuated by this foundation. I've been wearing a mask and I've been wearing sunglasses and I don't have visible signs on it and I love it. Um, I will zoom you in and you will see how it's looking. So here is my skin after three hours of wearing this foundation, which is pretty decent. I don't feel it on my face, I don't think that it accentuates my texture, I mean the texture of my skin even more. In the beginning I was actually thinking that I might use this foundation for my clients, but I will not. Um, the reason is that this foundation is so matte and so in some areas it's so drying that it will accentuate the dry spot even more and um, this is not something I want to see on my clients and um, currently I'm using the double wear by Estee Lauder and I am in love with it and I haven't changed my mind to switch to any other one and this one is not exception so it's pretty decent foundation but I don't think I will repurchase it
So this is the final look. I hope you guys loved it. I hope you enjoyed watching the video. Thank you guys for stopping by. See you all guys soon.